Hey everyone, Linus here. Today we're diving into the world of data centers and exploring the Uptime Institute's tier classification system. This system is like the gold standard for evaluating a data center's reliability and uptime. It's used worldwide to classify data centers based on their infrastructure redundancy and fault tolerance. Basically, it tells you how much downtime you can expect from a data center. The higher the tier, the less downtime you should experience. This is crucial because downtime can mean lost revenue, productivity, and even reputation for businesses. The Uptime Institute uses a four-tier system, ranging from Tier 1 to Tier 4. Each tier has specific requirements for power, cooling, maintenance and fault tolerance. Think of it like levels in a game. Each tier offers more robust features and capabilities. Understanding these tiers is essential for businesses to choose the right data center for their needs. It helps them align their business goals with the appropriate level of infrastructure reliability and risk tolerance. Whether you're a small business or a large enterprise, knowing the ins and outs of these tiers can help you make informed decisions about your data infrastructure. Let's break down each tier level in more detail. Tier 1 represents the most basic level of data center infrastructure. It typically has a single path for power and cooling, meaning there's no redundancy. If one component fails, the entire system goes down. Think of it like a bicycle with one wheel. It works fine until that one wheel gets a flat tire. Tier 2 adds some redundancy with N plus 1 capacity components. This means there are backup systems like extra UPS units or chillers. However, there's still only one distribution path, so maintenance can still lead to downtime. It's like having a, a spare tire for your bicycle. If you get a flat, you can replace it, but you'll still experience some downtime. Tier 3 steps it up with concurrent maintainability. It has dual distribution paths for power and cooling, allowing for maintenance without shutting down the entire system. Imagine having two separate power lines and cooling systems. You can work on one while the other keeps everything running smoothly. This level is crucial for businesses that require high availability and minimal downtime. Tier 4 is the most robust level, boasting fault tolerance. It has 2N redundancy, meaning every critical component has a backup and the system can handle multiple failures without any impact on operations. It's like having a backup generator for your backup generator, ensuring uninterrupted power supply. This tier is essential for mission-critical applications where even a few seconds of downtime can have significant consequences. Achieving a specific tier certification is a huge accomplishment for a data center. But here's the catch. Simply building a tier 4 facility doesn't guarantee tier 4 uptime. You need to consistently maintain and operate it according to those standards. That's where monitoring comes in. Think of monitoring like the sensors in your car. They constantly track things like fuel level, engine temperature and tire pressure, alerting you to potential issues before they become major problems. Similarly, in a data center, monitoring systems keep a close eye on everything from temperature and humidity to power usage and network performance. They provide real-time insights into the facility's health and performance, enabling operators to address issues proactively. Effective monitoring is vital for several reasons. It helps identify potential problems early on, preventing them from escalating into major incidents. It allows for data-driven decision-making, enabling operators to optimize performance and efficiency, and it plays a crucial role in incident response providing valuable information to resolve issues quickly and minimize downtime. Without comprehensive monitoring, even a Tier 4 data center can experience unexpected downtime. It's, a, it's like having a state-of-the-art car with no dashboard or warning lights. You wouldn't know something was wrong until it was too late. Now, let's talk about AKCP and their awesome digital twin technology. This tech takes data center monitoring to a whole new level. Imagine having a virtual replica of your entire data center, mirroring every piece of equipment and its status in real time. That's what a digital twin is. AKCP's digital twin technology provides a comprehensive view of the data center environment. It collects data from various sensors and systems, giving operators a detailed understanding of everything happening within the facility. This real-time visibility allows for proactive maintenance where potential issues are identified and addressed before they can cause downtime. But it's not just about preventing downtime, it's also about sustainability. 
With a digital twin, you can analyze energy consumption patterns, optimize cooling systems, and reduce overall resource usage. This not only saves money, but also reduces the data center's environmental impact. Think of AKCP's digital twin as the ultimate data center sidekick, always watching, always learning, and always ready to help you keep things running smoothly. It's a game changer for data center operators who want to ensure uptime, optimize performance, and operate more sustainably. So there you have it, a deep dive into data center tier levels and the crucial role of monitoring in maintaining uptime and operational sustainability. Remember, choosing the right tier level and implementing robust monitoring solutions are critical steps in ensuring your data is always available and protected. And with technologies like AKCP's Digital Twin, you can take your data center operations to the next level of efficiency and reliability.